Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In this video, I am gonna be doing a setup tour. Now, um, you're probably like, why are you like all the way over here and holding the camera all like all awkward like? Well, that is because um, if I'm gonna be doing a setup tour, how can I be filming with my normal setup? So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, for those film gurus out there, you can kind of see, like, my setup and how I film my videos, obviously, because it's a setup tour. And for those of you who are just, um, watch me and subscribe to me, I'm sure this will be kind of interesting, because then you'll get to see sort of a behind the scenes in a way, but this is, like, an updated version. So let's not waste any time, let's go! One, two, three, four, five, six, Okay, so I guess we can start off, um, actually let's start off at the door, okay? I, I, okay, my setup clearly in my room because, you know, I have nowhere else to film. Um, but yeah, this is just where I film, obviously. This is my background and everything. But yeah, you walk over here and you're at my setup. Now, let's start off with the mic. We have a, oh, if it, if it focuses. We have a Spark Digital, uh, okay, find my, find my finger. Right onto a shock mount that I randomly just bought. I know it was specifically made for Spark Digital, though. It was kind of like a generic thing. If we circle around over here, you get a little bit better light. A Spark Digital right here, and um, we also have the pop filter. Um, but what I do know is I have a PSA 1 road mount. Um, it's pretty nice. It's a swivel mount and you can just kind of move it like that. However you want, you can adjust it like that and it's pretty convenient. Moving on to my computer, I still have the same exact computer and that would be, uh, get a fancy shot here. Nothing too special, definitely good for editing though. Next I have a more Kloss & Co mouse pad from the time that my um, channel was actually called more Kloss & Co, alright? It, it used to be called that for those of you that have been around on my channel like <laughs> Um, my channel has been called More Claws & Co until I changed it to Claws & Co because this was supposed to be my second account but then I changed it to like my main um, YouTube channel. Next would be um, my um, mouse obviously right here. Uh, this is the mouse that I never use. It's an Apple Magic mouse. It, I would say it's pretty good for editing. I don't really play any games or anything on it so it's definitely not like, it's not like it's anything special for gaming or anything but it's it definitely gets the gets the job done when I, when I want to use it and feel like using it. Next would actually be that right there. Now that is super special now. It literally schedules all of my videos for the next, I'll say like month, I'm pretty sure. Um, so that notebook right there, very important. Top secret too. Next, I would actually have my camera sitting right there on that ring light. Um, probably a little bit hard to see because pointing it out directly at a light makes it um, pretty dark, but that, um, my camera would be sitting right directly, um, let me see if I can get the shot, right directly through there. Um, well, I'm gonna take it out. So yeah, that's how that works. It's in each shot, um, by the way, the, those, for, those of you who are wondering, it's in each shot now, um, just for drinks and stuff. Cut a uh, little like um, brain fart, I don't know what that's called, but it's not bread. And then I also have a nice Ikea desk. You know, it's, it, I'm planning on upgrading my desk soon because I, I definitely want more space, but um, it's a good size for right now. Now, what you see right here is not the whole thing, all right? I have one more thing that kind of um, makes everything a little bit more convenient. Now, part of my setup is obviously my windows, but um, my curtains are closed right now, so you can't really see that. But this little light, light right here makes it super bright. Okay, so this, when I'm filming at nighttime, lights up um, this part of my room, all right? If I turn this off, you'll kind of see a slight difference. Just makes it a little bit brighter, a little bit more alive as if it were daytime, but I'm actually filming at nighttime and it's being it's doing pretty well to um to uh um light up my room. <laughs> so I know this was a much shorter video and I'm so sorry. Um, but it is a setup tour, so I really don't have too much to show except for my light up there. Shout out to that light, that oh that that light. That's my setup. There's not too much that goes to it, um, except for the each shot, um, everything. I'll have everything linked down in the description, everything that I use. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you give it a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you'd like to see more. Comment if you have any questions or suggestions on any video ideas. And um, please donate. Uh, maybe it'll help with this shaky camera. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video.